Hello, this is the introduction to the Python assignment. The first thing you need to do is to go to codeacademy.com and sign in or register. And once you register, you would pick that you're going to do it for school, look for programming, then inside programming, you will find Python, and this should show up. The assignment to complete by December is the first six areas. But in each area, you will have just to do the first two parts. In here, it would be the Python syntax and the tip calculator. Do not do the pro trial. The pro trial, they will be charging you. So in like the string and console section, you would do the first two. In the conditionals, you would do the first two. Functions the same, the first two. List and dictionary, the first two. And then the student becomes a teacher, it will just be the first one. And, and that is all you're required to do. Now on each one, they do have a couple of lessons. So to get into the list, lesson, you click on it. Okay, so let's say, let's start with number one. And then some of these are just basically learning. In other words, you want to do what the instructions are. You just read the instructions, but sometimes they are already completed. Like uh, once you read the lesson itself, it just says to learn Python, click run to continue. I want you to push run. And it'll do, this is basically given the command of print this, and that goes to the screen. And then you would go hit next and just continue. You can stop at any time. And when you come back to work, it will be here waiting for you. Now, let's go to like number five. Okay, so for our number five, they want you to do something. Okay, you read the lesson. Okay, this says the code on the right is badly formatted. Hit run to see what happens. You should see an error message. We'll fix it in the next exercise. So I'm going to hit run. This is the error message. It says expected an indented block. In most programming languages, indentions does not create an error, but it will in Python. So what, what it's telling you right now is there's something wrong with this program, especially here it says line two. So I'm going to hit next. But if it says next, you can go on to the next one. Okay, so now after you read the lesson, it says on Code Academy, we'll use two space indentations uh, to make sure that you can easily read. This is just so it will help you read better. So in the instructions here, it says, Properly indent the code with the two spaces before eggs on line two and another two before return on line three. So I'm going to go in front of eggs. I'm going to go two spaces. And then the next one was in front of return. Give it two spaces. Okay, now I'm going to run it. And now it is running smoothly. So we made eggs equal 12. And we wanted to return eggs. So this function returns whatever x is and then we're going to print spam the function itself is called spam so it prints out the 12. okay so we would go next <clears throat> and you would continue like this so i would like for you to continue and do everything but i want you to turn in the last two okay so for like the modulo All right, it says to use the modulo to set spam equal to one. Okay, so spam equals one. 
you can use any two numbers that will leave a remainder of one to do this. Okay, so on line three, we want the result to become one. So we're going to take that off and then therefore five minus four is going to become whatever span is. So I'm going to run this. There it is, and you are done. Okay, the only other things that I want you to do for the last two in each section is to put your name and date on it. In order to do this, click in front of whatever you have in front of the one. As you see, there's a hash mark there or the pound sign. That says that that's a comment, so it doesn't affect the program. So I'm going to hit an enter there, go to the top, and put in my name. But it's still unread, so it's still programming. So we have to be sure we go in front of it and put a hash mark or the pound, okay? Then we could go to the end and also the date. So like today is the 30th. So shift pound and slash 30 slash 17. Okay, so that is required. Okay, and then I want you to upload this. So use your snipping tool. It's a new one. And what I would like for you to get is the, the title here and all the way over here. Okay, so I would like for you to upload this onto Word. And be sure you put your heading on top, Joe Cool, and everything else. And then do a paste. And there it is. So, and then you would indicate that this is one dot or one dot or one dash 12. Because this is the 12th one of the, fir uh, of the first group. So, you would do the same thing for 12 and 13. And you will upload the last two of every section. So that is what is expected on this homework.